Welcome to Essen Adventures in Food, and we're back again, Battles, with another food review. And today's food review is brought to you by Del Taco Battles, by the letter D, the Del Taco. But, anyways, Del Tacos reached out to us. They sent us a gift card. Thank you to Chelsea from Del Taco for hooking us up with the gift card so we could try out their new Dell's Real Deals. And we are, what's Dell's Real Deals? Besides being a tongue twister, Bato, it's food under two but two dollars or less vato so if you're on a budget there's no excuses there's about 15 items probably even more that are either two bucks or less vato so it's cheap and we went to del taco and we ordered all kinds of food and i'm here to bring it to you guys and you guys can check out what you guys can buy for two dollars or less you know so the first item i'm bringing because it's gonna get soggy like my grandma is uh i got the receipt vatos right here my one it's a three layer nachos vatos so it has beans, cheese, and it has green sauce. No meat, vatos. So this is more like a, I don't know if I could call it vegetarian, vatos. You know, I don't want the vegetarians to attack me because you say, no, beans are not vegetarian, eh? Because you get the pedos. I don't know, vatos, but let's give them a try. They look good. The green sauce is amazing on them. Damn. But let's try one with the beans, and it has the... The white cheese, the queso blanco. We're good. The beans taste like homemade beans. They don't taste like beans out of a can, but you know? So this is the first item. And uh, the wife is here, right here, right now, chilling. She's eating food too, but she don't want to be in the video because she's not all pintada, you know? She's not ready for camera. She didn't have no makeup, huh? I do. And I'm just so the next item, Vatos, is uh, what they call the crunch tada. What's a crunch tada? Tostada, Vatos. So it's mm -hmm. a pretty large okay. item. The size of my hand, Vato. You know, might have small hands, but it's a it's a large item, Vatos. And it has, once again, beans, cheese, lettuce, and your tostada, you know. Once again, no meat, Vato. Maybe that's how they keep it under two bucks. But it is what it is, Vato. At least you're getting food. To fill your panza, so that's all that matters. Where's the hot sauce you open, Mo? Oh, oh, the wife got hot sauces for me right here, so I'm gonna add some to the crunchtada, aka the tostada. The tostada's good. The wife already ate it, she said it's good, and it's hard. This thing, yeah, is, was, I won't say nothing about those. All right, it's good, about those, it's good. There's something you, I don't know how long it's gonna be around, but you keep this during Lent time because there's no meat on it, you know? Mm. Just a regular beans, cheese, that is what It's good. The beans, I'm surprised they taste, taste good. They don't taste like out of a can, but so. So, I tried the tostada. I tried the nachos. I'm gonna keep it moving. You have a nice one? Yes. We're gonna keep it moving, Vatos, to the next item on the prices right, Vatos. That's how I feel right now because we literally got a lot of food. It's amazing how much food we got. And the next one is gonna be their their guacamole habanero crispy chicken taco. And I said guacamole because Honestly, they call it the guac. To me, it's like, vatos, white guac? It's like you're gonna say guacatelas, you know? No, vatos, it's guacamole. I know people change the words, but I, I don't like the whole guac. You know, it sounds like your, your taco's gonna walk or, I don't know, it just don't sound right, vatos. But anyways, this thing has, watcha? <laughs> it's all parado, hanging out, a tortilla. It's a chicken tender. It has habanero sauce. You could choose ranch, habanero, and I believe chipotle. It has cheddar cheese. And this is the option of the guacamole one. And let's give it a try, vatos. You know? Let me give it another try. Through the back side, Vato, because the, like the front side, they really haven't really 
You bit, didn't bite into the chicken? Um, amazing flavor. I bit into the chicken. You put a lot of guacamole. It's decent, Matos. I don't taste no flavor in the chicken. That's my opinion. I taste the guacamole, I taste the cheese, but the chicken, the chicken don't stand out, Matos. So, it's good. It's less than two bucks, Matos. So, there's a, the chicken tender in there. And on to the next one, Matos. I want her. Now we got the, the chicken al carbon tacos and the tiny bottles. They're tiny, but they're probably packing a punch. So this one comes in a regular flour corn tortilla, has cilantro, has cebolla, has pollo, and has tangy green salsa, according to what it says. And I smell the, the carbon, the al carbon smell. No, these are bomb, Matos. <laughs> these are bomb. Mm. The chicken is like, like if you got it off the grill, off the street, you know when they're grilling the chicken and the cayenne? But to be honest, these are two bite tacos, watch out. It could be one if you wanted it to. Could be one, but once again, it's on the menu under two bucks, Matos, so these are good. Mm. You want a quick lunch, buy yourself a couple of tacos, of the chicken al carbon, mm -hmm. it's bomb. Those were really delicious flavor. Everything went well with it. Oh man. I didn't buy a soda because then that cuts into the budget of the gift card bottles, you know? We got sodas here at the house, so we just supplied our own soda bottles. Now this next one is the snack quesadilla. Right? Mm -hmm. The snack quesadilla. It's a, it's a decent size, Vato. It's, I think it's more than a snack. Um, damn. I thought this was a quesadilla, but watch, Vato, you open it up. Mm -hmm. So, you got the cheddar cheese, you got green sauce, and there's two tortillas on top of each other. Right? You know, like when my tias used to go camping, pues cochina used to lay on top of each other. <coughs> Just a little bit more fluffy, a little more skinny, Vato. But, here we go. Wow. That's good. It really has a strong cheddar taste, the cheese lapos. And like a really cheesy quesadilla. It's good. Oh, what else is there? Maybe it has, no, it's just the cheese that they put. It's really like sharp cheddar. Like it, it packs a kick of, of queso vatos. So it's a good snack size quesadilla, either for you, your kids, your grandma that has no teeth. You know, it, it's easy for her to gum this quesadilla down. So on to the next item, but those chingado. I'm in, I'm, I'm like Dal Taco Buffet right now, eh? So these are the, the Dal Taco chicken rollers. Excuse me. Um, man, that cheese is strong. I haven't tried that one here. No? No. This is a chicken roller. It has chicken in there, green sauce. That looks amazing. It's all nice and mojado and gooey in there. And it's bomb. You want to try it first? Sure. Off camera, Vato, and come back with a bite right here. I'm giving it to my producer. I, I gotta pay him. I pay him with food, my producers. Now it's my turn, Vato. This is a chicken roller, and. Mmm, man. So a chicken roller reminds me of the Al Carbon taco, right? I believe they give the same chicken on it. Just with flour. But it's just a burrito. You know, so instead of them calling it a burrito, they call it a roller because obviously they roll it up. That's good. It's a good 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 name for it. So the chicken roller and the taco al carbon are so far on my my top list, Vatos. Not the quesadilla. That yeah. <coughs> with some hot sauce. The quesadilla is good, but those two right now are my top two list. And then they have 
under two bucks, what those good. chips and guacamole, not guac. Guacatelas, not that, what those, it's guacamole. And this thing has real avocado in it, what those, it's not, look at it. It's chunky. It's chunky, eh? So, the tortilla chips, they look good. And man, it's a good decent size of guacamole, what those, cause nowadays guacamole is expensive. Avo Excuse me, what those, tacos coming out. Avocados are expensive, but let's give it a try. Is it good? Really? Oh, you want to try it again? Chingale. Oh my God. The guacamole is amazing. Has a lot of flavor, guapos. And I got jack for it. That's how amazing it is. Like. That's like a, a chunk of avocado. So yeah, about those, it has tomato in it mm -hmm. and probably other seasonings and spices in their guacamole. It's good. I recommend it. Get a side of guacamole. Not salty at all. You can taste the lime, huh? It has lime in it, about those. And if we're wrong, correct us down, Tugga, but we taste lime in it. It's amazing. And it's a good size of guacamole, so it's worth your less than $2, about those. And these chips are you good, know? too. Hard chips. And what else we got? We're missing the bean and cheese burritos, which you got the option. And the wife is squeezing it like this is like a go-gurt. No, I'm squeezing the, the beans. Yeah, it's, it's the go-gurt burrito. Man, this the is... what? Well, yeah. you're, you're squeezing like a go-gurt. This thing is monstrous, Vatos, for less than two bucks. Watch out. And this is the one with the red sauce. There's red sauce coming out the bottom. Like this thing is. You could choose what sauce you want. Yeah, green or red. And look at this thing is like like my tia's, you know, it's skinny, and then it goes boom on the bottom. But those, you know, all the de all deformed, but it is what it is, you know. I'm just giving an example what the burrito looks like. You see, look at it goes skinny, and then you know, like like watch out here, eh? but let's give it a try, Vato. Try it with some hot sauce, babe. It has hot sauce. We'll try it with some more. I want hot sauce. It's good about those if you're into bean and cheese burritos. Um, not one of my top picks, but it's good. For the price, you can't go wrong. Buy yourself. For the kids. Take your wife. Whatever, you're gonna take them on a hot day and buy them bean and cheese burritos. Just the outcome through shall homie, because it's gonna be World War Three once you guys go out somewhere and shit. But it's good about those. The beans, once again, they taste, look at, they're whole. They're like, I guess you could say they're homemade. I don't know about the, I don't know their process of the beans, but they are good beans. They're not canned beans. Yeah, who works at Del Taco? Let us know. So, they're good, about those. they're really good. Um, I think that's all we got. Huh? Well, we have other stuff, but it's not the, off the $2. No, I'm talking about the menu, not, not the... Not the panzon menu. No. We're talking about the two dollar menu because we went off the grid and we paid separate for the panzon menu, which are regular big ass burritos. But this is uh Del Tacos the real Dell's two dollar menu or less vatos. Um once again I would say the chicken rollers and the tacos al carbon are my favorite and the guacamole top three vatos I put top three. The other ones are good too, but it's up to you guys to try them. Everybody has different taste buds. Mm -hmm. My taste buds are probably all shot out. But those are something I'm saying, oh, that one's nasty. And I didn't say nothing was nasty because I'm it's I'll lie. Nasty. Nothing is nasty. It's just different likings to everybody. But those. So thank you once again to Del Taco for sending us out the gift card so we could try your menu. It was amazing. And when you guys got more new items, hey, hit us up about those because I want to try it because I'm fat, you know? No, I'll try it because. Shut We're going to put it out there, you know? But anyways, before we go, hit the like button. Comment below. You're sick. Share the channel, Vatos, and subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe. And hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Comment below. Let me know what you guys think. And if you guys want a Del Taco, and try it, Vatos. So until the next review, you Vatos have a wonderful day. You're sick, man. <laughs>